With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, here the question is, the sides opposite to equal angles of a triangle are equal. So now here let us make a triangle, here it is a triangle. So here suppose this is a triangle A, B, C and here in the question it is saying that here the sides opposite to an equal angle that means here suppose this angle is equal to this angle and here it is saying that uh, sides opposite to equal angle that means here opposite angle of this side uh, angle side is here a, a c is here opposite to angle b and here a b is opposite to angle this so here we have to prove that a b is equal to a c because these two sides are the opposites to this angle and here this angle opposite side is here this clear so now here let us start the solution here it is given that given angle b is equals to angle c and here we have to prove to prove a b is equals to a c now let us make some construction construction Draw a, perpendic uh, draw a bisector of angle A. Draw a bisector of angle A. So here let us draw bisector of angle A like this. So now such that, such that this angle equals to this angle because here we are drawing bisector. Clear? So now here this is suppose here its name, uh, name it is AD. So here here AD is the bisector of angle A. Now, now name us its angle is here. Here it is given that this angle equals to this angle. That means here suppose this angle is 1 and here this angle is equals to this angle. So here it is also 1. Suppose this angle is equals to 2. So here we are drawing bisector. So here this is also equals to 2. So now here we have to calculate this angle. So here we know that 1 plus 2 plus 3 is equals to 180 degree because the sum of the angles of a triangle is always 180 degree. So here we can calculate like this angle in a triangle, in a triangle, triangle A, B, D, A, B, D, angle 1 plus angle 2 plus, suppose its name is here 3. So here plus angle 3 is equals to 180 degree because sum of a angles sum of angles of a triangle is 180 degree. So, here, so now here we get angle 3 is equals to 180 degree minus angle 1 plus angle 2. Clear? Now suppose this equation is here first. Now in a triangle ADC in a triangle A D C here in a triangle A D C we see that angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle A D C this angle suppose this name is here 4 so here we see that angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 4 uh, angle 1 plus 2 plus 4 is always is equals to 180 degree because the sum of the angles of a triangle is always 180 degree so here we can write like this angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 4 4 is equals to 180 degree. Clear? Yes. Similarly here, like this here, because some of the angles of a triangle is 180 degree. Clear? So now here we get angle 4 is equals to 180 degree minus angle 1 plus angle 2. Suppose it's a second. So now here from a uh, first and second we see that the angle 3 is equals to this and here angle 4 is equals to this. So here we see that this angle is equals to this angle. So here we can write like this angle 4 is equals to angle 3. Clear? So now here in a triangle in a triangle A D B in a triangle A D B and in a triangle in a triangle A D C a D C here here angle 2 is equals to angle 2 that is here angle B A D is equals to angle C A D angle 
बी ए डी इज इक्वल्स टू एंगल सी ए सी ए डी बिकॉज हियर एंड बोथ बिकॉज वी हैव ड्रॉन बाई सेक्टर सो हियर हियर ए डी इज द ए डी इज बाई सेक्टर बाय कंस्ट्रक्शन क्लियर सो नाउ हियर we see that this angle here equals to this angle now here we see that angle adb is equals to angle adc here three four are equal because here we have seen that from first and second so here we can write like this angle angle adb adb is equals to angle adc here and here we see that ad is common in both the triangles AD is common. AD is equals to AD, common in both the triangles. So now here we see that this angle equals to this angle, and this side is common in both the triangles. And here this angle equals to this angle. So here we can say that by ASA, ASA congruency. This triangle is congruent to this triangle. Clear? So here we can write like this. Here triangle. ADB is congruent to triangle ADC by ASA congruency. Clear. So now here, if these two triangles are congruent, then we say that AB is equals to AB is equals to AC. A B is equals to A C. Clear. So now here we have to prove that. So here we say that hence it is true. So here this is our answer. I hope you understand. Thank you. For class six to twelve, I T J and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.